This is the second video in my series on concrete design and detailing with BIM. In this video, I'll cover the benefits of modeling concrete structures in Revit. Be sure to check out all the videos in this series. Building information modeling BIM is a critical part of how structural systems are designed and built to date. But the reinforced concrete industry has been lagging behind structural steel when it comes to its adaptation of BIM. This is due to the highly fragmented nature of its supply chain, which requires a number of different designers and suppliers to collaborate and simultaneously deliver the final product. When we ask our users what they want to see in a BIM-centric solution for concrete, we often hear a variety of answers that differ drastically depending on someone's role on a project. Engineers and designers um, want to gain more engineering insight while creating the design intent of structures, seamlessly um, coordinating with the assistance of uh, analysis tools and local building code requirements. Fabricators want to maximize production and uh, delivery efficiency while minimizing the time spent on detailing and coordination with the field. Contractors want to optimize planning and estimation tasks by determining accurate quantities in the early stages of a project, thereby streamlining the installation process to avoid river clashes on site and uh, coordination with other trades. Despite the differences in opinion on the BIM solutions needed for reinforced concrete, it is clear that the industry is ripe for radical disruption. Over the last several years at Autodesk, we have made a commitment to address the due opportunities our users are asking for by investing in customer-centric solutions for the reinforced concrete industry that better connect concrete design and detailing to fabrication. I bet now you would like to know what are the benefits of using a Revit-based strategy? What value does it provide to Revit users? We see BIM-centric uh, concrete solutions help our users in four main areas. First, this approach combines the versatility of 2D documentation with the high level of fidelity and accuracy of 3D modeling of steel reinforcement and concrete accessories with minimal effort to produce both. It allows Autodesk users to design and detail with crash prevention in mind to reduce clashes both on the pre-construction and side execution project phases. Revit enables the transition from design intent to detailed models while respecting both perspectives, following low code requirements and automating the processes of making changes so they are less disruptive to the project. It increases the transparency and quality of model information being used from bidding to procurement by not only providing quantifiable information, but also enabling access to it in collaboration-friendly environments. Now, assume conceptual model is received from the architect. And then the structural engineer creates the physical and analytical models for the structural system. Revit has multiple tools for defining and editing the analytical model. Then the model can be exported to various analysis software uh, that are interoperable with Revit, including well-known robot structure analysis professional available together with Revit in the AC collection to perform structure analysis, right? The results can then be imported into Revit and reviewed to understand the impact of various design changes. With the results now available in the Revit model, RIBA definition can begin. There are two approaches to this process, one for Europe and the other one for America. First, the structural engineer analyzes forces and proposes reinforcement patterns a practice typically encountered in North America. The engineer can use engineering schedules or place tags in 2D or 3D views that reference uh, concrete elements and reinforcement patterns. Secondly, 
Riba can be determined I mean, more directly by structure analysis results while respecting the local design codes, a method usually embraced by European countries. The beauty of Revit is that it allows for both approaches, enabling all structural engineers to work in a BIM environment connected to architects, MEP engineers, and the extended project teams. In the next section, I will explain the key Revit features for reinforced concrete.